<laughs> oh, and by the way, I'm leaning back against the wall in a really weird maneuver. So I was going to do a live weigh-in on the scale today and I totally forgot. I have no reason to sit here and lie to you guys. Mentally, I'm not doing very good. I'm just kind of struggling. What do you mean? As you guys know, I suffer with really bad anxiety, anxiety and depression, depression and I suffer from gallstones. I feel like some other things and um, I finally made an appointment. But what about your phone anxiety? To see someone who specializes in anxiety, depression, uh, bipolar. Personality disorders. Stop! I've heard enough. This is the doctor you need to see. I don't have some of those things, but I'm just saying. Honey boo boo, you might have some of those things. Um, someone who truly specializes in that. So. This is all sounding very familiar. I took the freaking plunge. I got a fucking therapist. I did it and I am over the moon to the hills we go. Moo, moo, moo. And the cow fell with the spoon. I am over the moon to the hills we go. Moo, moo, moo. And the cow fell with the spoon. I have officially made an appointment and I'm probably gonna be going back on medication again. Wax the pro, wax the pro, wax the pro, wax the pro. I don't like taking medicine. And it's just, I really need to do this because I'm just like not in a good mental space at all. I wish that I wasn't like this and it's just like, it is so exhausting for me. <sighs> It's already exhausting enough just being a bigger person. Girl, go take a break in one of those chairs you got from Walmart. Things are just harder lately and I'm trying to do things more and just get up more and move more. And um, that does include me taking breaks and sitting on a chair. So that's what I'm doing right now. But it's like terribly exhausting to have these mental problems and it's just like mental things is scary it's hard for me to have this job and to keep up with you know uploading several several times a week and it's just like my mind won't let me my mind is just like going through a lot right now and it's like when i do come on here i look crazy so i wouldn't say crazy i'd say a hot mess my hair is probably a hot mess right now eric go to your own channel oh my god i really do look like an absolutely insane person <laughs> um i already filmed a little bit of like a meal that i was making but you eat it all before you could show it. But ever since then, I have just... A lot of crying. Ah, emotions. <laughs> and just misery. Misery. All right, that's it. People killing people, dying, children hurt, and you hear them crying. Do you practice what you preach, or do you tell the other cheek? Allah, 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 help us, send us guidance from above. Cause people got me, got me questioning, where is the love? Where is the love? Um, it, it hasn't been good. Have you learned nothing? Misery.
Sorry. But I'm still gonna show you guys that really long clip and it's just gonna show you definitely the difference between, you know, how quickly my moods can change and um, stuff like that. So anyways, so here's that clip. Hello everyone. Hello everybody. I'm still wearing leftover makeup. Leftover pizza, leftover spaghetti, leftover makeup. Bad. Habit. That's all I gotta say. I'm not the only one in the world. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm just making some food. Bell pepper, <laughs> onion, and chicken <laughs> sausage. I can show you guys the brand, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put some Cajun seasoning on this. So I'm pretty pumped. <laughs> but the brand, please don't mind my mess. <laughs> is this alfresco sweet Italian style chicken sausage with red and green peppers. <laughs> you can honestly get this from Walmart. Cause that's where I get it. I'm pretty sure like Kroger's has it in other places, but for one is 130 calories. I got it from here, Am. It has seven fats, two saturated fats, zero trans fats, 65 cholesterols, 400 sodiums, which really is not that much. Two carbs, so if you're watching your carbs, this is gonna be good for you. I know nothing about net carbs. It's got one sugar, guys, one sugar, and 14 proteins. So, I'm actually gonna have two. So, I'm gonna put these in the fridge right now. So really quickly, I just want to show you some things I got from Walmart. Becky, that's your cue. I'm sorry about that. This is a Yasso bar. I haven't been having any sweets at all for, it's been a while. Girl, you is a lie. So this is actually a frozen Greek yogurt bar and it's only 100 calories. It's the fudge brownie. I've never had this kind. So I decided... 593.6 of these. It's totally fine. Um, it's real Greek yogurt, no high in intensity sweeteners. Um, it's all just pretty healthy. No honey, healthy is not the word you're looking for. Hey. Two bell peppers. And then I got three bags of this Asian, it's Asian medley, yeah, lightly seasoned Asian medley, it seems fresh. I got three of those, because I actually like to have this whole bag with literally just a side, just a side, I feel like this is the main course, <laughs> with turkey burgers, no bread or anything, just, it's so good. And then I got another thing of the chicken sausage because that's super good too. So this is how it's looking now. It's pretty much done. Doesn't this look delicious, y'all? I wouldn't eat anything you cooked. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Oh my god. You guys could do anything with this. You can have it with rice. Huge bowls of rice. So you can have it with a big potato, which you is know, what I'm gonna do. Don't you have like a box to go paint or something? But um yeah, so it's almost done. They are, you know, I did it earlier. I'm telling Becky stole your mashed potatoes! No one cares! You guys, if you want to know something about Becky that's like a little random tidbit. Absolutely, I would not. When um, Eric and Ricky cooks, she likes to steal random little bites of their food. Yes, I do. And I get to, I watch in glory, but it makes me sad because I'm like, I want to try it too. Ricky, Ricky's a good cook. I took him out of the mashed potatoes. Ricky is an amazing cook. Sorry, I'm trying so to- you. It's just you cook things I don't really like. Yeah. Healthy. Just gross. So we're having a baked potato. This meal 
definitely reminds me of that mukbang. Mukbang, 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 mukbang. Feelings, feelings. Excuse me. I pronounce things horribly. Anyways, that sausage mukbang. Difference between that is though, that sausage mukbang consisted of um, kibasa, which it was a high calorie meal type thing. This whole meal is 480 calories, but I haven't eaten today at all. Oh my gosh, this looks so good. Don't be afraid of sausage. The word sausage is such like a... The fact that I'm a lesbian. It's one of those things that people just automatically assume is like super unhealthy. Um, for me, the fact that I'm a lesbian, this chicken sausage has been a lifesaver because it is, it's low sodium compared to kibasa. It's um, lower carb, it's lower calories. It has more of a natural ingredient. So I'm gonna find me a fork and I'm going to eat. This is my first meal of the day. And again, oh my God, I'm sorry. I need, I should have taken off my makeup, but this is me. Like I vlog my life. I don't live a life to vlog. Um, oh, my brain, it's not wanting to function. Um, wait, does that make sense? Okay. Anyways. If that makes sense or you guys even understand what I'm saying, I don't know. I feel like I'm just not even making any sense. <laughs> But um, yeah, I was gonna say my meals are super simple and that's just kind of how I like it because I don't want to get overwhelmed and I feel like I'm not really, I don't really like to cook, like let's be real. So I would much rather prefer to have super simple meals that taste good and that are healthy, have the nu nutrients that you need in them than to be like super complex and like crazy and stuff. But I really do want to follow some recipes. I think that'll be really fun for you guys to watch. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Because I hate recipes. Hate, hate, hate. Makes sense. I don't think I've ever followed one in my life. We know. I like to wing things. So I think it'd be really fun, maybe like to have my subscribers like send me recipes and then I try one. And then whichever recipe for me seems like the easiest and most um, concise. T-Series, yeah. it's your big day. Whoa. Incredible job. I know we had our differences, but today I just want to tell you. Hey, congratulations. I choose on though the most like whatever is you can come in here <laughs> whatever like works the best with like my weight loss plan that's the one I would choose I'm trying to wash my face <laughs> yeah mm -hmm, sure I just washed my hands you guys these mashed potatoes look bomb though you guys look they taste good too Becky stole a bite of that oh I know I was in here she was gone she was like making a small plate. She had like mashed potatoes. She put some peas on it, green beans. I was like, bitch, what you doing? Oh, what is that? Chicken. Let's smoke half green. Are you trying to eat? Are you here? Yeah. Tell me that's not good though. Try telling me it's not. That's good. It's like five calories though. Oh, it's so good. Damn. That's like, bomb. Did you not hear me when I was sitting there? I was like, what did you do to this chicken? I was like, dang. I was like, what the f did you do? Yeah, that's good. Very proud. I wish I could take credit. <laughs> it's mine. Now I'm going to go eat mine. Yum. Amber Lynn, we've been through so much in this video and you can't even say goodbye. Let's be real. Girl. Bat.
if my cat says bye. Throw the horse between the bean bags and hurt. <laughs> Atlas. Look. It just wants food all the time. <laughs>